party, ladies and gentlemen. Where are the ice cream crews? This is day two. Day one was pretty small, so we didn't do anything. Literally, I only took the wagon out for some fat laps. But uh, they're expecting 2,500 cars around the track, 15,000 people. This should be a hell of a day. I'm so freaking keen. What? <laughs> I said I'm glad to see you're off holiday. <laughs> off holiday. <laughs> oh, it's so majestic with you next to the American flag. Do I look ripped? Oh yeah, bro. The camera adds like 10 pounds of muscle. <laughs> but yeah, so like literally all around the track. Again, everybody welcome to Ice Cream Cruise. All the way around the back there. And then like the gate to get in. All the way down there. And then all the way out to that gate, which is insane. Oh, look at the rig. Look at the RV trailer. And the wagon. Oofed. All right, so we're a little bit late to the driver's briefing. But it's all right, because Tyson's doing a scrutineering anyways. So we're all good. So I think I missed the driver's briefing. But at least, let's check out this path. So there's no real tip-in road. It's like literally you just start and come in. Um, and then literally, I don't know if you can see it, but right here, the line down the center of the pad, here, it's all like uh, they screeded it or scraped it or brushed it when the concrete was wet. From here over, they didn't, and it's just smooth, it's glass. You can almost see from like the lack of tire marks, whereas here it's just black. So super slippery to the point the cars aren't even making smoke, and then super grippy. So game plan is going to be, because the wind's blowing this way, I'm going to try and start come in I'll use this area to uh, let the smoke disappear because the tires are gonna smoke less and then I'll just try and go back to that corner stick to this area maybe whip back around that way. but it's hard because whenever you actually try and make a game plan it never happens so we'll just have to see how it goes oh my god are you that guy from Australia uh, no that's not me <laughs> oh look at Tommy's get up oh do we have to sign something oh yeah we're signing you got game face on? Game face. Game face, baby. So all the zombie garage boys ready to rip. Yesterday when they were testing, it was freaking epic. Everyone got tires off. It was a party. It was a real party. So crazy to see, like, just the American scene all together, how far they've come. It's freaking epic. But oil's changed, full of fuel, tires done. All we can do now is send her, bud. But yeah, she's ready to rock. Awesome, ready to smash. Oh, yeah. I want to thank the sponsors, Golgurt, for getting us out here, <laughs> keeping us, keeping us fed and healthy, yeah. <laughs> hydrated with yogurt. I, don't you know, I think so, right? With yogurt, you, you Americans are different. You built different. Rating down the hatch. Instant rating. Uh, nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Seven point five. The wild berries, are nine out of ten. Yeah, but even though it's cherry, it still just tastes like grape. Everything in America tastes like grape. That's not a grape time. That was a bad joke. Don't get too close. Top what, secret. What's your secret? Top, top secret, secret pressures. Secret, secret pressures. Yep, yep, yep. So Jacka's tailgateless at the moment, but we're going to be fixing this thing after this event. We're going to be fixing it up for SEMA. So it's going to be going to get a fresh new look, and uh, it, it's going to be sexy. It's going to be ready for top sixty. Well, I guess it's going to be ready for SEMA. He's built. Jacko is officially building a SEMA truck. So yeah, hopefully by the time that's loud. Hopefully um, by the time that they get through all these cars. That pad's gonna be nice and hot and sticky, especially on that slick side. I'll probably still click it into top gear for the whole skid. See how it goes. Uh, I'll end up, I'll see how it feels, but with the shape of the pad, the size of the pad, the fact that half of it is like glass, I'm gonna be going for a safe skid. Not a ball to the wall like Power Cruise or anything like that where you've got a huge pad. So we'll see how this goes. Holy shit, there's a lot of people here. Doing it strong for the Aussie team with Big Jacko's Lux. We're here and we're clear. <laughs> oh, how cool is Brent's car? <laughs> What's in this? The engine was built for a turbo racing car. Wow. MS. Sounds great. Oh, it runs great. Too. <laughs> it's fun. It's perfect for this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It loves it. 
I'm just excited to rip with you guys. <laughs> I'm excited to rip with you. It's been a hot minute. I've been watching all your guys' stuff. That's so cool. Jones to get out there with you. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. Ready to punish it. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Something's going to go. <laughs> it's going to be ties. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, so good. Cannot wait to rip. So yeah. Parachute with an ice cream flag, ice cream cruise flag. That. That's so cool. We're the best part of the event now. This is definitely the best part of the entire event. The puppy parade. Doggos. Can I pet that dog? Can I pet that dog? Yes. Go pet that dog. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, Jack's giving me nothing. He's not yeah. happy with his skid, so he's giving yeah. me nothing. Right. I'm on the downer right. <laughs> I'm trying to get happy by looking at puppies. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're over at staging now. Waiting for, um, what do you call it? Awards? Announcement? Placings? I don't think I'll be in the top three because uh, the Kelly brothers showed up last minute and all three of their cars performed perfectly. I got smoked out because my game plan obviously went out the window, got smoked out, got off it for a second, and then kept going, and I think stopping's a deduction. So other than that, I think I would have done all right. Good pad use, it was a safe skid, but I have to see how it goes. All right, so Seth got first, which is absolutely unreal, because his skid was flawless, especially for an NA car. He absolutely smashed it. Every corner absolutely of the pad, bulk smoke, those colour tyres did so freaking well. So good. So freaking good. Rigged! <laughs> Jacko's telling me he's got, got me some good content. Oh, he, even he... Even he's getting his phone out. <laughs> Loves it. Sorry, it's his fault. No, no, no it's his fault. Yeah. Turbo blow up on that earlier or no. It's fine. I mean, I don't think so. It still sounded pretty good. Yeah. Still spinning. Uh, no, I blew the upper radiator hose off, which sprayed me with everything. Um, and then my clutch line is like pinched in my power steering rack, so I have no clutch. Nice. So they were going to deduct, not that I had any chance of winning. It was only like 45 seconds in. But like, I was like, I don't want the points deducted for not being able to drive this, so I shoved it in first and started it. Yeah, yeah. That car was What? Yeah, car cruise. I tried asking him to give me a ride, he just gave me the keys to his car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that the one you drive to the showers? Yeah. That's so funny. That's the one I got up to about 10 minutes. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Well, that's awesome. Well, that's awesome. Well, that's awesome. Clickbait lives for another day. So impressive. Like they're probably along with Zach, Seth, there's a, there's, a, there's a couple of them, but those boys there are some of the best drivers in America. It is wild. So good. Hey. You gotta do it now, next. Fuck. You gotta do it now. Nah. <laughs> no. Nah. Mine was a $300 engine. How much is this one? Uh, I won't say on camera. <laughs> no, I like had to sum probably like 40 grand, but I mean, you'd only hurt the like 10 grand part of it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I think we've. The spot? Is. The spot that's a nice spot without putting it on the paint, but it will stay. But there. the. Where are you going? Oh, yep. Oh. That's very nice, Jacko. Uh, it's a respectful See, and he won't even know that we did that one. And he's going to wonder who did it. Yeah, that's a respectful Yeah, right yeah. So any, anyone that knows Kyle knows that whenever he gets a chance, he puts these little magnetic dicks all over your car. I thought that he was checking the wagon for safety or checking the seatbelts or something. Then we get off the pad and there is just magnetic dicks all through the car. So I think it was Austin had the, the bright idea to dick the man that dicks everyone. <laughs> Saying dick a lot. But Jacko, that was very, that was very dick, tasteful. I'm the dick ringleader right now. <laughs> I'm out dicking him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's the best one too, because I wonder how long it'll be before he f realizes that's there. That's a blender in -er. That's a blender in -er. oh, yeah. this, this is like the most American thing ever. Is he old enough to drive? Oh my God, he looks 12. Where do you, go? Do you have your license? <laughs> There's a full-on limo, there's seats inside, no one's inside. <laughs> oh, hey, hey, dog. Hey, I was too busy just walking, watching. Oh, the paparino. Hi, little puppy. What? Look at this! Do a wheelie or an endo. That's a yank tank. That's a yank tank. That is hot. Now that fucks. Fox. Look at that. 
Alrighty, so it is the next morning now. Uh, after the fireworks, we kind of just hung, chilled out. The party vibes weren't as crazy as we were expecting, so I think we actually had a pretty early night. But wagon seems to be absolutely mint. Blew the clear view out, absolutely spotless. We do have a bit of a boo-boo that may have ended our weekend though. Um, I rim bashed the shit out of those steelies. There wasn't much left on them to begin with. And I think they're done. And they're our last set that we've got. So we need to buy some more, but I think that means we might be done for for the weekend. So yeah, there's nothing left on the inside. I mean, a couple mil on the outside. I don't think that'd hold, but that'd be why we uh, got beached coming back in. Cause we got one of the other boys rims. And if you look at how deep that is, and this is already been, this has been rim bashed as well, but then you come to this, nothing. But look how deep that is there compared to there. I mean, we could try and put a wheel on it, but I feel like as soon as you put air in it, it'll end up just freaking pushing over the bead because there is not much of a bead left. But I guess you can't be mad saying that we uh, had a good crack and a good effort with those freaking steelies. Just can't stop a good rim bash. It's the Australian way. It's the Australian thing to do. Violence against rims must stay. Ben life. This is the most jacko thing I've ever seen. Oi, quality in 4K. <laughs> Broomstick alignment. <laughs> Alrighty, so luckily enough, we've already set a 17 from, uh, from Seth. So if the only thing is, obviously, I can't pop, pop them, otherwise, I'll be on the ground. But power skip shouldn't be popping them. So we got them fit up thanks to the help from Tony. They've got a little tie machine that they can mount to the front of their um, trailer. So just got to try and get air in them now. Get them on the wagon and then we're pretty much set to go. Alrighty, so they're finishing off some racing now and then they're doing power skits. They told us to come and line up, but me and Jack are the only ones here right now. Hopefully there's more people that come and do it. But it's super hot today, which I mean is good because uh, better to get the oil up to temp. So I like it when it's warm out, especially like you let it run lean and then you just let it heat soak in the sun with the engine being black, so it works well. So I'll wait for this racing to finish. Austin. Words of, words of wisdom. Words of wisdom. Uh, no matter what you're dreaming and if anybody hates on it, at the end of the day, it's your dream, not theirs. Oh, so never give up. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Alrighty, so we're out on the track now. Line up the power skids. Don't know, I think they asked me to go last, but I don't know. I'll just jump in at any point. But, so you got all the burnout guys that are obviously doing it. <laughs> Look at this. Dude, this thing is spicy. Actually, it looks too good to be doing this. <laughs> That's what they all say. Yeah. That's right. We just need to have some fun. Uh, it's gonna be dope. Yeah, I, I hit it when we came out. I heard somebody else give her a little. Wah, yeah. Wah. I was like, oh, I'm gonna try that. I Hell hit it. yeah. I was like, wow, immediately. <laughs> so yeah, it's gonna blow the tires off. Oh yeah. Well, that's the point. Yeah. I don't know what y'all expect out like gear rating is. Yeah. Mine's um like I got a 30 diff gear in the back. The standard turbo 400 like ratios and then so like in in top gear at 7500 it's doing like 220 mile an hour yeah yeah you should definitely win then <laughs> it's, it's loaded for you to win Bob. just just depends if the car wants to behave and go straight oh without hitting the brakes yeah yeah yeah, yeah. so if it doesn't behave and you have to hit the brakes do you just keep going for the crowd uh well at that speed if it's getting out of shape then like oh, i'm yeah, not gonna yeah, fucking yeah. bin the car yeah, so yeah. just just get off it but then once I get off it, I'll probably just get back into it again. I'll have to worry about bending my passenger seat because, you know, it's plastic and it's zip tied in. Oh, awesome. True street, bro. Car's <laughs> really nice. Oh, yeah. You should look at the seat. <laughs> God, this thing's awesome. Thanks, bud. We do a bunch of no prep small tires. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, it's, uh, you know, if you have a YouTube channel, then it's just a slippery slope away from being a burnout guy. Yes. You know it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every fucking YouTuber's got a goddamn fucking burnout car. Yep, yep. And I've, never, I've resisted, you know. I've got them sitting at the back of my field at the house. <laughs> so I, Once I, you do it uh, once, it'll be, you, you'll, be, you'll be hooked. Uh, see, I think my, the fuckery is like, I can't do it with a turbo OS. You can't yep. do it with an Axis OS. It really needs to Need a blower. Blow yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm keen to see this thing go. So this is also where all of the uh, roll racing cars have been. This has been roll racing all day. 
all day. And it's still there. Jacko is great success. Great success. Great success. This motherfucker thinks that he can beat me in Connect Four. Easy. Oh it's wow! It's like a Sunday walk in the park. I'm <laughs> 70 degree with a nice breeze. So he called me out. So we had to park the Harleys. The All right, you, you, the hogs. The, the hogs. hogs. All right, I'm going first. All right. I win. All right, nice. <laughs> Rookie mistake. Good thing I'm the editor. You gotta love your dog. Let's take first try. <laughs> All right, I'll cut back in once I whoop his ass. You can't cut. Oh, I just beat him. Of course, he tries to hide the evidence. Oh, schooled him. No, one and done. One and done. One and done. No, put your shit on the trailer. <laughs> All righty, so we're getting prepared for night skids. I think there's like after party and then an after after party. So skids. So after Matt Watts saw my story on Instagram and said those rims still have plenty left on them. We put tires on them. Oh, but look, oh, that's okay. they're meant to finish up here and they're here. Like the tire is just holding on, but if they're on, we'll smash them. So I'm more than keen. Jacko's going up now, so this will be pretty freaking good. Alright, someone literally passed out from Jack's car. So they made a stop, we're good, we're going again. Uh, yeah, go second, yeah. Okay. Austin's doing his first skid. Let's go. We got fucking, we got Devin's car. You want to go up? Yeah, I guess. Oh, 
I guess no one said no yet. Fucking shit. Let's go. You like me to spray the radiator to help cool it down? Oh yeah, that's a that's a great idea. This isn't even my car. It's buddies. I'm gonna keep it low so you don't suck it. So I'm trying to get as little in the turbo. Perfect. Perfect. So I got my foot on the brake, I'm on second, and then went to sounds, go to third? I guess. And he was, yeah, yeah. This isn't your car, is it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, ready? Good to go. Let's stay in that. Stay in that. So that you you have officially been dicked. Oh yeah. Yeah. That, that was Jacka. That, that was Jacka the other day. Oh what? <laughs> 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 I was like, what Jacka dicked. He's been dicked. dicked. He's been dicked. He's been dicked. Jacko, so right, pretty, pretty good shot of this. Let's go. Go ahead. I'm gonna record. Come on, wait on you, Jack. Hold on to these fucking right yeah. no, 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 you don't want to do that. No? Wait till he starts in pain. Wait till he starts in pain.
God. Well, I guess that's ice cream cruise done. Our first ever one, and holy hell, we will not miss it again. But the best thing, even after the after party last night, with plenty of skids until like 2 a.m. in the morning, she drove in the trailer, boys. Oh, I'm so proud of this car. What a beautiful sight this is. All the zombie garage guys drove their cars on the trailer. So not only did they give them a hammer and all weekend, all freaking weekend, but every single one of them drove on the trailer. That is so freaking good. Now, annoyingly, when you're also a competitor in driving, you never get to film any of the other cars. And then with Austin, I mean, he's not a filmer, but he likes cameras like me. With him riding passenger in one of our cars, he also doesn't get to see any other cars. So it's hard to film them all a lot of the time. And then sometimes, like, I just didn't want to enjoy watching these guys skid for most of it. Words of wisdom. Words of wisdom. You know, even if you fail 99 times, you ain't failing, you're learning. Because the 100th time you knock, the door could open. So keep going. <laughs> oh. But either way, it has been an unreal weekend. I mean, there's, there's so many interesting things with the dynamics of the way events work here. Like, for instance, how, like... I got a better one. You got a better it one? It takes rain to grow flowers. You got to embrace a thunderstorm for your life. <laughs> okay, that was a good one. That was a good one. Um, but, yeah, the fact that, like, three-day event, so I was expecting, like, massive day Friday. Huge... Saturday was a huge day. But there's just, like... The days wouldn't start until, like, 12 o'clock. Events, like, power skids yesterday were at 6 o'clock at night, and then we are skidding at, like, 2 a.m. in the morning. Just interesting dynamics because I'm so used to like in Australia where it's like 8 a.m. the action starts and it's all day but made it for so super chilled super relaxed the vibes are absolutely unreal we will be back 100% next year with more Aussies and I dare say the zombie garage guys will be back next year as well Woo! yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs>